In the not too distant future, next Sunday AD, there was a guy named Joel, not too different from you or me. He worked at Gizmonic Institute, just another face in a red job suit. He did a good job cleaning up the place, but his bosses didn't like him, so they shot him in the space. <laughs> creepy girl. Oh, creepy girl, little creepy girl. <laughs> Jeez, what's wrong, Tom, sir? Well, you look as upset and downtrodden as a little robot with inarticulate limbs can look. Oh, it's creepy girl, Joel. I just met a girl named Creepy Girl, and suddenly I find... I <laughs> smell a song coming on. <laughs> oh, creepy girl. Kyle Wagner's a total jerk, second only to Tommy Kirk. Could you find it in your heart to love a bot like me? That fishy story you tell always makes me sleepy. But that's just what I get for dating a girl that's creepy, my creepy girl. Oh, C is for that feeling of uncertainty for not quite knowing what ethnic group you're from. R is for the gifts you give me every time you smile. The first E is for, uh, well, I don't really know, but the second E is really a grammatical thing, because otherwise it would be creppy girl, and where would that leave us? The P is definitely not for platonic, and why? Because I love you, my creepy girl. Oh, what are you, creepy girl? Are you French, Italian, or one of those swarthy gypsy types? <laughs> well, your accent suggests a romance language, but I can't be sure. Oh, we can definitely rule out a Germanic language, but it's okay. I'm a bot without a country. All I know is that I love you. I want to shout it from the mountaintops. Uh, but I'd have to get back down to Earth and actually climb a mountain. Or they could just drop me off on a mountain. I don't care. That would be okay, because I just need you. My... Creepy girl, won't you be mine? I'll give you scrolls and fish and tinker toys and wine. I'll ditch these guys if you'll be my creepy girl. Be mine before movie signs. I'm confused. Uh, just who is this Godzilla guy? Yes, wise one, please teach us. I don't know if you're ready for this. Oh, please, oh, please Mr. Joel, please, 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 come on, please, 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 please. All right, please, okay, please. my little robot friends, but we only pass this way once. This is oh. called the Godzilla genealogy bop. Would you hit it, Professor Cambot? In order to know Godzilla, we've got to look into his past. You know, studying genealogy is going to be a blast. Uh, you got it, little robot pal. We're swinging into high. Hey, come on, let's cut to the chase, you couple of geeks, and get to the family tree. Well, it started with a nuclear blast and pets that were released. Oh, like, like baby alligators? alligators? And other, other nasty beasts? beasts? Right. The fusion reaction caused them to grow a thousand times their size. Well, that explains Godzilla's attractive tail 
and thunderous thighs. Right, mm. now you're getting it, little buddy, but now we must move on. Uh -huh. Godzilla's not the only one to benefit from the A-ball. Yeah, look, there's Auntie Ness from Scotland's Lock. They married in the spring, and their firstborn was Godzuki. And now we begin to sing. Godzuki went to Hollywood, an agent to the stars. He had an affair with Lauren Luft and smoked those big cigars. And out of the lusty Luft affair, Rob Perlman resulted. Huh. You know, surgery was considered for him, but nobody was consulted. <laughs> no, I didn't then care. Ron met Yoko Ono, and they began to spawn. A couple of hundred horrible things as green as forest lawn. There they are. There's Kermit the Frog, the Swamp Thing Hulk, and Ernest Borgnine, too. But Ernest Borgnine isn't green. Well, you put him on a boat and he is. What? Hey, who's that down at the bottom? A wallowing in a shame. Oh, that's just Steve Gutenberg, a Police Academy fame. Huh. To wrap it up, the worst mutation? No, you don't suppose. Oh, yes it is. The horror of horrors. Carl, Carl Malden Snows. Hey, it wasn't my fault that we showed the Phantom Creep at the end. Uh, it's Dr. Forrester who calls all the shots around here. Uh, uh, if you ask me, that chauffeur had the right idea. As a matter of fact, I've prepared a little number. If chauffeurs ruled the world, it's what I'd like to see. Cause everyone in the world Would take a back seat to me I wouldn't have to drive I wouldn't have to steer Cause all would bow down before me In total abject fear All the gorgeous dames would worship at my feet. Why, I could have any one of them I want. Even Meryl Streep. I'd have complete respect of everyone on the planet, including intellectuals, even David Mamet. Tell me why do I have to take orders from this guy? I'd like to drop him in a bucket of boiling grease and watch him slowly die. That's enough, Frank. If chauffeurs rule the Frank. world, Frank. it's what I'd have to see. Cause That's everyone enough. in the world would take a back seat to me, mammy! Oh, hi, Crow. Oh, hi. What you doing? Oh, we were just inspired by the cool new age music of this movie, so we decided to uh, use the wall of keyboards and make our own great new new age music. You want to help? Sure, uh, what can I do? Well, I could teach you how to play the keyboards. Will it take long? No, of course not. Come on over here. Here, <laughs> check this out. Okay, put your hand, come on, put your hand over here. Okay. Put your finger down, like see? Like that? Yeah. Oh, see? Yeah, cool. you got a, you're playing a new age chord now, okay? Hey. Just like Yanni. All right, now, put another finger down there. Okay. See, now you're playing a Yanni lick. Now hold it down for an hour. Yeah. Now hold it down till you get a record contract from Wyndham Hill. Oh, hey, cool. Servo, check it out. It's my new New Age Yanni Lick. Uh, Joel, hold down my new New okay. Age Yanni Lick. I gotta put my sandwich okay, down. Got it. This music's kind of dull, isn't it? Yeah, but it's a good way to make a lot of money without a big initial investment. <clears throat> okay. And now, music from some guys in space. Tonight on Music from Some Guys in Space, more fine, new, new age music and sounds from super progressive Bay Area new age keyboardist, Joel Robinson. Joel will be accompanied on the wall of keyboards by veteran minimalist, Crow T. Robots. 
We invite you to sit back and enjoy more repetitive new age music as we cruise the spaceways. Come along, fellow travelers, and enjoy music from some guys in space. Hey, we got movie sign, you guys. It's movie sign. Next time on Emergency 911. Tom, you're stuck in arrow shoot its neck. mode. Come oh, on, oh, man. Oh, Snap oh, out of it. Oh, Crow, wake, wake up. up. Movie Come sign. On. We got movie sign. More fish flakes, sweet friend. Oh, Tibby, my Tibby, my heart is a mess. I don't have a protective shell over my chest. So people can hurt me with the cruel things they do. Yet somehow, sweet Tibby, I know you hurt too. Oh, Tibby, my Tibby, reality's hard. So, Tibby, let's play in the yard. Oh, Tibby, oh, Tibby, he runs like the wind. A couple of inches, <laughs> and then back again. Lord of all. Uh, may I take a verse? Well, if you feel it, Crow. Oh, I do. <clears throat> well, Crow, then by all means, join me, won't you? Five, six, seven, eight. Tippy! It's Tippy! Uh, oh, Tippy! Sorry, sorry, sorry. I love you, my fine little fella. Sweet. Even though you gave the whole family salmonella. No, no, it's not their <laughs> fault. It isn't their fault. Crow, you take everything good and you rip my heart out. <laughs> Jeez, I, I'm sorry. Come on, Crow, let him finish his song. Come oh, on. okay. Go That's ahead, a Tom. stupid old turtle. Go ahead, Tom. Thank you, Cambots. Tibby, my Tibby, your blood may be cold, but I know that your heart burns as hot as a coal. It burns with the love only turtles can feel. Tibby, is our love real? My Tibby, I'll never let the dog nose around your bowl, but you know that, don't you? I can see it in your beady little eyes. If you high center on your rock, Tibby, I'll be there to help you down. The toilet's not your fate, friend. You'll always run free. Tibby, long as you have me. Do you realize a robot just sang a love song to a turtle? That was really good, Tom. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but now, right here in our satellite, a bright young juggler and magician, let's have a big round of applause for Gaius the Great. Juggle or something, come on! Come on, oh, please, come on! Third one, get back to the first one, it's almost a... Oh, my God. And now for Thank the youngsters. Thank you. We have to cut away now for the youngsters' commercial sign. You guys are worse than Alan and Rossi. Thank you. Well, guys, looks like it's time to pack it all in again. Now we are the stuff dreams are made of. Oh, that's beautiful, Crow. Shakespeare? Uh, no, Burma Shave. Oh, well, I can... Huh? You know, guys, it always Ow. hurts to close it all up, yeah. strike the set, Ow. wipe off the grease paint, uh, napkin up the blood and entrails, Ow. and move on to another town. Uh-oh. I smell a song. Tell me where does all the magic go? 
When the curtain falls to end the show Do the clowns always cry When they pack up the paper sky When the champagne is being poured And the lock is on the old stage door Will there still be a clown in the sky for me? <laughs> oh, no. Don't worry, buddy. There'll be other experiments. You really think so, mister? Yeah, take a verse. It'll cheer you out. Okay. When the Harlequin is on the pad and the whiskey hangs around his head. William Holden's coming over. Tom Servo, if you don't clown. stop doing your Anthony Newley, I'm going to throw you against the wall. You'll do it, too. Will there still be a clown in the sky? Don't crow. Well, still be a clown in, in the, the sky. sky. Take it home, Joel. Tell me where is that clown in the sky? I love you, Tom Servo. I love you, Joel. I love you, Crow. You're not my real father. What do you think, sirs? <laughs> waffles, waffles, waffles. Join waffles, us, everybody. Waffles, Come on, Kim. I'll give me triple berry. W is for the many ways that you serve. A is for the admiration you deserve. <laughs> And F is for the flavor that is second to none. L is for how light you are, you melt in my mouth. And E is for A. Take it down, oh baby, put them all together with a how do you do? Lovely waffles we love. Turn me up another, please. Oh, waffles we love. Top my off with runny cheese. Waffles we love. Chili waffles should be fine. Oh, waffles we love. Wash me down with Aunt Jemima. Oh, waffles we love. Yeah. I think it's kind of uh, hot to be wearing these scarves in oh, here. Yeah. Well, the scarves are must. You can't go caroling without a scarf. Catch your death. Man, you were like one of those kids I remember in uh, high school that used to sell the most candy bars for the marching band. <laughs> yeah, and you'd yeah. be president of the swing choir, too. <laughs> uh, thanks, Joe Robinson. Thanks, Tom Servo. <laughs> what a kiss up this guy. Uh, okay, now, if you'll all look at your sheet music, uh, we can rehearse my new song. You wrote a Christmas song? Hey, there's no tradition like a new tradition. <laughs> Wait a minute, let's have a Patrick Swayze Christmas? Uh, yeah, yeah, based on my favorite movie, Roadhouse. Come on, what the heck does Patrick Swayze have to do with Christmas? Hey, you keep Christmas in your way and let me keep it in mine, okay? <sighs> oh, uh, come on, sir, it seems like a nice enough sentiment. We can give it a shot, come All on. All right, okay, okay. 12-8 uh, time, uh, uh -huh. key of A flat major. Oh, uh, Cambot, shoot him the tune. Uh, okay, you'll just have to stay with me, everybody, okay? Uh, your parts are written out. Let's have a Patrick Swayze Christmas. By Crow T. Robot. <clears throat> Paul, let's have a Patrick Swayze, Swayze Christmas. Christmas. Right. <clears throat> Hit it, Cambot. Oh, oh, I start. I yeah, get it. I'm sorry. Okay, pick it up. <clears throat> Open up your heart and let the Patrick Swayze Christmas in. We'll gather at the roadhouse with our next of kin. And Santa can be our regular Saturday night thing. We'll, we'll decorate a bar stool and gather round and sing. Oh, let's have a Patrick Swayze Christmas this year. Or we'll tear your throat out and kick oh, you oh, in the ear. Hold it, hold it, it can't but stop it. Crow, Gee. I don't know if I think this is an appropriate sentiment anymore for Christmas. Hey, what, like a good action sequence don't belong at Christmas? Well, well no, it's just that I've never heard of an action sequence in a Christmas carol before. Yeah. Well, then grab hold of your socks and read on, Joe Robinson. Okay, okay. pick it up from measure 20, Kamba. <clears throat> Lovely intro, though, very tasty. Thank you. It's highway or the highway this Christmas at my bar. I'll have to smash your kneecaps if you bastards 
touch my car. I got the word that Santa has been stealing from the till. I think that that right jolly old elf better make out his will. Oh, let's have a Patrick Swayze Christmas one and all. And this can be the haziest. This can be the laziest. can be the swayziest Christmas of them all. La, 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 la. How long before it becomes a standard? I think you got to come with me. Come on. Ah! Joel, I hate movies where the men wear shorter skirts than the women. Boy, don't you know it? I can just imagine a common scene from the days of ancient Greece. Oh, hi, Hercules. Have a seat. No! <laughs> you are so right, little Lizzie, buddy. Hey, Kambach, cue up the music. That's why we put together a little musical presentation honoring one of our favorite garments. It's a little thing we like to call pants. 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 Sing the praises of pants. pants. Nothing better shows my taste than what I wear below my waist. Say, pants. <laughs> pants. Sing the praises of pants. They help me suck in my gut. They always cover up my butt. Oh, pants. Pants. Sing the praises of pants. Wear them and you're a cool guy as long as you zip up your fly. Zip pants. Pants. Sing the praises of pants. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, consider the pants. You know, the Pant Association urges you to wear your pants at least three times a day. The great men of our time have all worn pants. Roosevelt, Churchill, De Gaulle, Gandhi. Well, well almost all of them. <laughs> Dolphins, one of the smartest mammals on Earth. Do they wear pants? No, but they wish they did. That's how smart they are. What keeps our legs all warm and hot? Pants. pants. What prevents a buffalo shot? Pants. pants. What have they got that I ain't got? Pants. pants. Oh, you can say that again, then. Huh? Ladies and gentlemen, presenting in her one woman show, Gypsy. Here we go. There's a big frontier out there called life. I ain't nobody's daughter, I ain't nobody's wife. I'm gonna state my very own claim of land, and you're gonna wanna know who I am. I'm Gypsy. Gypsy rules me, Gypsy rules, not you, not you, for you, Gypsy rules me. All right. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Hello. Good day. Happy to see you. I, Crow T. Robot, have penned a little ditty in honor of the star of today's experiment, Kim Cattrall. Uh, it's called Oh, Kim Cattrall by Crow T. Robot. 
<clears throat> sung by Croti Robot. It's marked Allegro con Brio, Kershaw Listing 643. <clears throat> Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall, Kim, 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 Kim Cattrall. You were in Mannequin, and that was a really good movie. Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall. Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall. Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall, Kim Cattrall, Kim Kim, Kim Cattrall, you've never made a bad film, oh what the hell, ring my bell, let's go to the Dells, our relationship will gel, I like your smell, you're really swell, I'm trailed in Heston for Contel, I love you Kim, I liked your dress at the Ace Awards, Cattrall! Fellas. I've got something to say, and there's only one way to do it, so give me center stage. Hey, be my guest. It's all Thank yours. You. <clears throat> As you guys, I'm sure, remember, I think it was maybe last December, mm -hmm. I fell pell-mell for Kim Cattrall. <laughs> yeah, we remember. Please don't remind us. <laughs> but now I'm over that. Well, that's good. We had a little spat. <laughs> In your dreams, buddy. I'm older, wiser, and I know that my true love is really named... Estelle. Winwood? She's swell. <laughs> she's cute. She's Rudy Toot Toot. I bet she smells like juicy fruit. She can really play a witch. She was even on Bewitched. And I'm bewildered and bothered. Oh, but Crow, hold on a second. Hold on. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Crow, you are my buddy. But maybe I'm a fuddy duddy. But step back, please, and think about some stuff. Like what? I'm sure that she seems nice, oh, yes. but I bet she's more than twice your age. Well. And with your love, it might not matter. But can she control her bladder? Shut up, shut up. Oh, come Gee. on. Okay, okay, but Joel, there's a whole other set of issues here. <laughs> If I may, Crow, as a friend, as a trusted advisor... Well... Okay, here's a quick list of people much better looking than Estelle. You're so shallow. Fred the Litnikoff, Brandon Tattergoff, Sid and Marty Crow. Very funny. Fred Gwynn and Anthony Quinn and Rin Tin Tin and Pearl, Billy and Ma, Ridley and Mayor, Dilly and Hank and Phoebe I'm Snow. I'm not listening. Ethel Merman and Pee Wee, Herman and Strom, Thurman and Vince Lombardi and Borgnine, Mirror and George and Jesus Jones. I don't care, I don't care. Edith Head and Mr. Red and Nostra, Dumas and Danny, <sighs> Thomas O'Neill and Sherman Hem Please. Don't make him stop. Come on. Tom, you're not helping things at all. Now, can you go and please oh. clip those coupons like you promised? Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, Willie DeVille and Agnes DeMille and Crow Willie DeVille and Roscoe Tanner and Jan Winter. Crow, listen, don't worry about it, friend. Why don't you explain more about how you're feeling? Thank you. She's a vision. I got a new mission. Somehow I got to meet her. So she's older, too. Three, four. She's got a great motor. Two, three. There's nothing that can beat her. Crow, Two. You she's Rudy to two. I and bet I she smells like juicy like fruit. She can You're really my play a witch. Go she was even on the witch. Cause I'm bewildered, bewildered and bothered. Oh, I'm telling you, Gypsy, I love you. And I know I'd love you, too, if Why only Why are you could... having a chance with a girl like her? It's me she cares for. Isn't that right, Gypsy? I can't decide. Can't decide? Well, maybe this will help. I can't sleep or clean my room Since you and I first had our swoony swoon Ooh. 
in early June under the clear blue gypsy moon. Oh, that's nice. Thank no, you, no, honey. no, don't listen to him, honey. Listen to me. I should. Oh, others have their tune. I know that I was meant for you. Ooh. Yes, one and one makes two, and that would be just me and you, honey. Ooh. Strolling arm in arm under a gyp, gyp, gypsy moon. Oh, very good. Take my hand. Oh, in Tom said her macaroons, his family are all baboons. Oh, but wait, my wait. love is a typhoon, and besides, my dad's a tycoon. Oh, my dad has got money. So come with me under the jip, jip, gypsy moon. Ooh, Don't listen to that pin beak Hold over there. Up. Listen to yeah. me. I am a starter for the broom, so don't you leave my heart in ruin. Oh, I've been in a cocoon, but now I sing just like a loon. Ooh. Since you and I sang tunes under a jip, jip, gypsy moon. Well, I've got something to say. Yeah. Tell me, tell me. Although I just as soon take my equal with a spoon, then listen to you two drone on about the gypsy moon. If the choice is between you two goons, I'd rather date Stacy Coons. I think you judge too soon in this matter of the moon. Because when the lights go out Ooh. and we're sitting on the couch, Ooh. I'm going to give you everything. Uh, we hope you enjoyed this little trip down memory lane. And now here's our own Al Jasbo Collins with a message. Never again, you guys. That's it. He's hired. He's hired. He's hired. I'm hired. He's hired. I hope I don't get fired. He's hired. In 40 years I'll be retired. But for now I'm simply hired. He's hired. He's hired. He's hired. I got a job today. He's hired. I'm selling Chevrolet. He's hired. I'm bringing home good pay. He's hired. I just got hired. He's hired. He's hired. He's hired. He got a job yeah, to me. He's selling Chevrolets. He's bringing home the same. I just got hired. Hired. I was wondering if you'd like to see my no. But I really think you should see my no. It's got a lovely no. And if only you would No! Can't you see we're trying to tell you no? Zeros Zeros None of my salesmen Has ever sold a car Sometimes I think I might be pushing them too far I think I'll hit the bar And try to get my mind off zero Zero All of my salesmen are Good evening, Sonny. Hi, Dad. You look depressed. I am. Come on and have some lemonade. Thanks, Mom, but that won't help. Just get it off your chest. Okay. I suck at my job. No, you don't. Yes, I do. My salesmen are slobs. No, they aren't. Yes, they do. I'd like to make a sale, but what can I do? I'm gonna be a failure just like you, Dad. Like me? That's right, I'll be a failure just like you. Oh, oh. son of a... X-Tree, x read all about it. Pearl Harbor bombed. Roosevelt declares war. Well, that's it. What's it? Uncle Sam's gonna need cars. Why, selling Chevrolets is gonna help the war effort. Don't you see, Dad? Come on, everybody. See you. See you. We got commercials.
commercial sign. Oh, oh, no, what's the point? Uh, hey, Camba, could you do that music again? Yeah, good. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Joel Robinson, and there's nothing that sets my heart a wandering like the sound of a train whistle. Huh? The call to the open road, the urge to check it all and hop a freight train is one of the most romantic notions of the century. Bro. That's why we've decided to write our own train songs. We hope it brings out the same traveling vagabond everywhere I hang my hat is home spirit in you. Joel, if you will. Thank you, Crow T. Guthrie. I hear that train coming, coming round the hill. I hope that is my train. I'd better check my schedule. Oops, that was the train to Appleton, but it's going to Circle Pines. Yeehaw! And I've got about 20 minutes to kill. It's good thing I brought some magazines. Huh? Been riding on this old train, been riding it all night. I think I'll go to the club car and get myself a bite. Mm, this tuna melt sandwich really tastes quite nice. Oh, I got sesame seeds in the bun. Plus, it comes with coleslaw and a pickle, and I must say it's reasonably priced. Carol. 515 from Duluth, oh my, it's just derailed. The toxic waste is spilling, the conductor's been impaled. A benzene cloud has risen, and the whole time's starting to call. <coughs> Within a matter of days, all of our skin will fall off. Gonna be the best Thanksgiving break ever. Oh, you yeah. betcha! I can't wait to get home. Oh, bye, bye, Mr. Schlotsky. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, kids. The bell has rung. School is out. The kids have all gone home. All I do is sweep and pout. I'm left here all alone. I make sure the hallways are gleaming. I keep all the garbage at bay But inside my heart will be screaming How did I end up this way? I'm a janitor, a janitor I clean up the puke at your school A large fistful of sawdust Is my essential tool I'm a janitor a janitor I start work early each morn I have a drinking problem and a large collection of porn I'm a janitor a janitor I'm looked on as kind of a leech but at least I get more respect than the ones who have to teach he's a janitor a janitor Please don't sell him short 
If you get him to my hand, I'll show you my disgusting wart. Ooh, he's a janitor. Yeah, I'm a janitor. A janitor. You got a problem with he that? He needs to be loved and respected. He once dated Josephine the plumber. And guess what? Yeah, I was rejected. Oh, figure. He's a janitor. A janitor. A janitor. Yeah, I'm a janitor. We both think he's pretty keen. I hope you liked our presentation. Now back to Deep Thirty. I was alone, I had lost my way Until one wonderful, wonderful day When I met a friend made up of fur and fuzz A friendly little friend whose friendly name was Nami Muffin, Kugel Butter Scrappy little pal like no other his name is kinda long, so you could just call him Muffin. Whatever you call him, I sure as heck love him. I love him even more than my father or mother. Nami Muffin, Coco Butter. But then one day, unexpectedly, Nami Muffin, Coco Butter was taken from me. The loss of that pet has left a really big void. My subsequent behavior would even startle Freud. When it comes to pets, there'll never be another like Nami Muffin, Kugel Butter, Nami Muffin, Kugel Butter, Nami Muffin, Kugel Butter. Go back, Nami Muffin, Kugel Butter. I love you. Hi, folks. Welcome back to the satellite. As a special treat, Crow, <laughs> Tom, and I have written and are going to perform an original Christmas carol. Uh, uh, Mike, it's not just for Christmas. It's for holidays of all faiths. Yeah, right. don't uh, call it a carol because no. carol is a woman's name, and we want this song to be all-inclusive. Right. Why don't you hit a camera? There we go. Let us all now sing our praises to the Lord today. Although you may not share our belief system, which is perfectly okay. Maybe you worship an abstract being that is kind of vague. Or maybe you just worship a guy whose name is Greg. Perhaps your religion doesn't include a time called Lent. But whatever your religion is, we support you 100%. So sit around the fire and have a chestnut roast, chestnut roast. or raise a glass in a toast, glass in toast. to happy days, Donny Most. But if you prefer to eat Indian food on Christmas Day, I can only shrug my shoulders and say namaste, namaste. Personally, I prefer Personally, turkey gravy and salad but let's never forget all cultures are valid so let's have peace on earth and cut out all the bull let's have a holiday season that's multicultural. if there's one point we'd like to make with this festive holiday song it's that Christmas comes just once a year, so for a few days for crying out loud, can we all just get along? Hey, wow. that was actually pretty good. That was great. It was hey, lovely. Good job. Very nice. Oh, oh, Frank, we'll miss you too, but yeah. we'll always remember the good times. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, we have remembered the good times. Cambot helped us hit it. TV's Frank, this one's for you. It's going out to our very special friend. Frank, the sun never shone upon our love before Until there was Frank uh, uh, you, from me to you, sweet floppy Frank 
we've had a lifetime of friends. An endless Frank will always flow for all we know. For all we know. Frank, from the first day I knew your name, I never knew love was the same. Never knew love was the same. Open the vine, sweet Frank on the line. Nothing but sweet love and friends. It's Frank. knowing that love could be frank if only the sun and the moon would collide to be frank. Let me be frank about Frank. Let me be frank about Frank. Let me be frank about Frank. Cause Frank is the best Frank that's ever happened to me. Please, please don't go. <laughs> oh, bye, Frank. You were enjoyed. <laughs>
to the engine of my car. I could tickle my Aunt Lil, or give my dog a cyanide pill. But what frank-shaped boy could they possibly fill? Here's my money. You can bank it. I'm no good without my Frank. It seems he could die without batting an eye. Now it seems I must take my own bitter pill. Tell me who, who will I kill? <laughs> Goodbye, Frank. And remember, wherever you are, I will kill you! <laughs> Say, fellas, there sure is a lot of skin in this movie in there. There sure is. Yeah. Yet despite all the acres of flesh in this film, I just can't come up with a word that describes it. Well, I can. You can. Why, sure. It's breastica, boobical, chestica, mammical, pendular, globular, fun. Flashical, orbital, mandula, scupula? Right, oh, that's the one. Is it gluteal, maximal, tushital, cracula, bunula, morning till night? Well, your absoto, glandular, fanny, fantastical, mastoca, fleshular, right? It's an areological, autoerotical, tubular, bobular, joy. An explosular, regional, bachical, pouchular, fun for girl and boy. A latissimal, dorsical, hung like a horsical, caliphalogical ball. The most bun. Funula, funula. Fruit of the lumula. Frenchical tongular. Wabada bobular. Funula, funula. Fruit of the lumula. Frenchical tongular. Wabada bobular. Tusa bobular. Tusa bobular. Tusa bobular. Hey! Hey, guys! How's the movie? Oh, it's breastica, boobical, chestica, mammical, pendular, globular. Oh, I don't want to have movie signs. Here. 